To see if I succeed To see if I believe They're looking up to me They want the best of me now Best of me now Best of me now Best of me They want the best of me now Best of me now Best of me now Best of me They want the best of me Okay guys, so here we are. Um, here is last week's measurement. You know how we do. I was at 198.2. Uh, been killing it all week, so hoping to have a good result. So let's go. Okay guys, 197.8. And I gotta be honest with you, I am not feeling really good. We are 12 weeks out, so 12 weeks out in 2020, I was at like 185 or something like that. So not feeling good. Um, so kind of pissed off. Um, gonna take some progress pictures here later. Um, I forgot my underwear, so uh, but just got done with some sweaty cardio, so I'm going to shower up and uh, come back later and do the progress pictures. All right, what's up, guys? Your boy Jay does for Shizzle back in the hizzle. Hope you guys are doing well. Shout out to everybody that's tuning in. All right, guys, man, not going to make this real long. Um, we are exactly 12 weeks out from the OCB Buckeye Natural. And um, um, got to be honest, man, you know, after weigh-ins, not feeling good. But again, this is why we take the progress pictures so that we can see the changes on our body rather than on the scale because weight is a lot of things, man. It's, it's water, it's muscle, it's fat. So, you know, and I try to do my weigh-ins consistently every time that I do them. So I will do my cardio. I kind of, I, I like to fast before I do my weigh-in. So the day before I, I pretty much fast um just drinking minimum fluids kind of kind of like the day one day out before you know your show you want to you want to minimize the fluids you want to minimize like you know your your food intake and things like that so um it's not going to have a negative effect on the scale you know even though i'm burning calories while i'm working out and then you know um doing my resistance training and then doing the cardio it's still you know it's always sometimes it <laughs> sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. But right now my body's really fighting me. Um, this is I'm recording this a few days after weigh-ins. Um, I, I've been having some complications going on uh, medically, so I actually had to go to urgent care yesterday. Um, everything looks good right now, but they want me to see a specialist. Um, so you know I can't really get in all of that. You know medical, you know HIPAA reasons and things like that. Um, so it's uh it's kind of frustrating right now being 197 uh i was talking to coach sarah and uh and she was saying you know don't compare you know 2020 to um where you're at right now because our bodies change you know year from year to year you know and things like that so but that was my best look was in 2020 so i'm, I'm comparing everything to then so 12 weeks out in 2020 i was about i think 185 or something like that um and and then i started having uh i was i was in a plateau and then next thing you know the next week i was like boom i was like 174 or something like that and then it was like 171 160 like you know everything just started kind of flowing so you know I don't want to be discouraged, but guys, if I'm 197 right now, I have 50 pounds to lose in these next 12 weeks, and that's going to be very, very difficult. Um, I was hoping to be, you know, 24 pounds down right now, you know, 12 weeks into prep. Um, so it is what it is, man. I'm going to keep grinding. Um, I actually got a big leg day today. Maybe I can get it filmed. I know I brought you one a little while ago. Uh, when I went to snap fitness, but, um, I'm going to, I'm going to hit a new gym today. I went to another gym last week and uh, I thought it was going to be dope and it, it was kind of whack. 
Um, but I'm gonna go to another one today, see if they got a day pass. It, now this one looks really, really dope. So hopefully I can get some of it filmed for you. I know it's a leg day, it's nothing new. Um, this is gonna be a big leg day. Um, they have a hack squad, so uh, I really want to get some hacks in today. But other than that, guys, man, I will throw the I will throw the um, uh, my progress pictures in right here, man, so you can see, you know, uh, from week one until now, week uh, what is this, 13 for me uh, on my on my prep. Uh, we are, I think, on week eight on the pro physique transformation challenge and um you know so i i do the progress pictures there too from day one until now i think we're at uh 50 days 51 days in We've got like 40 days to go so i'm feeling really good man it's like you can see that you can see the changes man so this is why you take the progress pictures guys so don't beat yourself up man if you're on your fitness journey and you know the scale's not moving and things like that again i am a scale junkie so i beat myself up a lot um, but I am trying to bring my body fat down so I can see the muscle definition, you know, and while I'm, you know, on that stage and things like that. Um, if I'm not there, I'm, I'm honestly not going to do the show, guys. And I really want to do this one. It's in Columbus, my home state uh, capital. Um, and, but then uh, we have the Battle of the Great Lakes Naturals in August as well. So uh, if I don't do the Columbus show, I'm definitely going to try to make sure that I do the Cleveland show again so and redeem myself there um anyway guys man I didn't, like i said i didn't want to make it too long that's all i got for you man just stay on your grind stay on your purpose be strong keep your head up stay on you know uh you know get out of your own head and uh, you know we we gonna rock this man you know i'm, I'm gonna keep doing the best that i can uh, my business is taking off now so um i can kind of make my own schedule and uh so i've been i've been i've been you know i've been rocking it uh, it's been just a little bit difficult, but you know we gon we gon we gonna make it happen, man. My my schedule's not as busy as it was last year. You know my mom's doing 100 percent now, so you know uh, I'm still do the heavy lifting for her and my dad and things. And I'm a single dad, you know, so running around with my daughter. She takes her driving test tomorrow, so you know hopefully she can <laughs> relieve some of the stress too, you know, uh, by driving herself to school and things like that uh, here shortly, you know. So that's all I got for you guys, man. I love you. And there's nothing you can do about that. Your boy, Jay Dizzle. I'm out. Peace.